Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Scorpio, this is a collective tarot reading session for you, Scorpio. I hope you're doing well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is a collective reading for the Scorpio sign. This is a collective reading for the Scorpio friends out there. Thank you so much, Scorpio, for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. This is a collective reading for Scorpio. We will pick up love, career, finance, and general situationship, okay? This is for the sign of Scorpio, please. What can I get for Scorpio? You have the page of wands. It's coming towards you, Scorpio. Four of cups. You have the six of cups in here. You have the Judgment card. You have the Sun card. You have the Ace of Wands. You have the Nine of Wands. You have the King of Swords. We have the Justice card. And your overall energy is you have the Moon card, Scorpio. Hmm. I feel like, Scorpio, you are in a deep thinking process. Okay? I feel like Scorpio, very soon, you are going to be thorn between two lovers or, um, because this is two, you know, I feel like Scorpio, you are about to enter or you're sitting with this energy right now, but it's deep thinking that produce deep feelings. Um, you're in between like two decisions, like a crossroad or something that will I go, will I say yes? But there's something exciting as well as you make a decision. There's something in here that really will spark excitement, Scorpio. There's a little bit of fear of what's new, what's going to happen. But there's also undeniably um, some sort of excitement. Yeah, I'm seeing two, two, two. Scorpio. Hmm. Oh my gosh, three of wands. This is something in the future, Scorpio. Um, I honestly feel like this is love. So for those single, Scorpio, oh my gosh, I'm so happy for you. Um, for those single, Scorpio, very soon, you will meet a person who is in alignment of your energy. Now, this person, it will not totally what you want, what you expected, but I told you, Scorpio, once you connect with this person, once you let it unfold, let the, let things shape up, you know, without controlling, you will be feeling like, because you're overthinking in here, you know, there's a, the moon card, like you're overthinking, overfeeling it. I feel like you like the person 60%, 40%. You're a little bit hesitant in here. So you're in between, will I leave it? Or will I go for it? And for some of you guys, you could be leaving someone behind. And then you could be trying this. But partly 60% of your heart still wants the person in the past. But there's also something exciting about the new person. So you're in between. And deep feeling, deep thinking. But I feel like you'll go for it, Scorpio. With the three of wands, there's something... I'm kind of picking up that if you look into what's your future, you definitely will not choose the past you will choose someone new. So if you're kind of in between two decision, two person, two situation, two places, I want you to decide and look into how do you want to see your, your future? Because if you ask yourself and you look into if I'm going to be deciding and I will look into my future, you'll definitely go for someone new or the new one. Because the new one feels moving forward, Scorpio. Hmm. What an exciting person or an exciting change, I would say, Scorpio. No fear. Have faith, okay? So that's that. Now let's pick up more intuitive message for you, Scorpio. You have the Page of Wands. See, this is what I'm telling you, Scorpio. Yes, you've got the Page of Wands. This is a good news. Um, I feel like this is a good news, but you're hesitant again. Look at that. Because of the past. See, this is this is a storyline story I'm picking up. 
So you've got some good news, Page of Wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Yeah, Three of Pentacles. You have a good news. This is good stuff, but it's in a preliminary stage. It's in a reshaping, okay? It doesn't necessarily will unfold what's in the future. I mean, we can just get a preview, a snip, oh, like a sneak of the future, but we can't totally predict that, you know? We can get, as, a, as an intuitive reader, you know, it always changes, but we could get one specific in the future, you know, when it's decided, when all of, you know, a prediction, it's like concrete or it's solid when all of the parties has a similar energy, then you can predict the future. But if it's changing, it's quite unpredictable, but there's still going to be a part of it that you can predict intuitively with this reading. If you base on your intuition, if you feel the feeling attached to this person's situation, it's exciting. But your past is getting into the way. This is a new person. This is a new person. This is the new life. You know, there's something Scorpio that's trying to come out for you. Like this is, you know, like something is unfolding and somehow you're scared. I feel like this reading or this person, this situation will liberate you. But you're somehow scared to leave the past behind could be a person like this is something unique this is something that you've never dealt with this is something not that you're not quite sure yet and you're trying to intuitively gauge the future gauge the future and you you can't make it up again because this one and this one and it just sends like a, a scrambled signal but if you feel the feeling based on your intuition you might four of cups consider this newness like there's a part of you as well, Scorpio, that you're delaying it because of the past. But eventually, I feel, I feel like you'll go for it, Scorpio. Yeah. You know why? Because the person will pursue you. The person, the situation will pursue you, Scorpio. Hmm. Strength card. And the King of Pentacles is in here. Whoever this person or situation it is, it feels like brand new. Or it's an idea it's a situation that is already existing but in the past it was passive now it's like a volcano it is super duper active but it's coming it's like it's coming to you judgment card this person is situation it's coming to you it's coming towards you it's making some noises and it's coming to a point where it has a competition from your past or there's a part of you that somehow you're decided with the past and then this came along. It's exciting, but you're quite scared. This is also like solid exciting, but also there's a part of it it's old or it's crack or it's glitch. So you're in between. I feel like you same reading with Sag because this is the past and some, someone new. Um, you've got the strength card in here. I feel like somehow you will let this and you will let this be. I feel like you will be in between. You know, you will be in between in here. I feel like you, yeah, Page of Pentacles. I feel like Scorpio, um, you will take all of, like, you will, you will use all of your resources to compare this person and this person, or this offer, and, sorry, this person and this person, or this offer and this offer. I feel like you, you, you're going to use all of your strength, your muscle, your resources to compare two offers. Yeah yeah two offers it's two offers you're torn between two lovers and i feel like with the sun card in here um i feel like it's more of you're not stress i feel like someone's gonna be able to guide you that hey take it easy you compare them properly there's no rush because i started the reading so like not not unpleasant but more of a more of nervous but i'm looking at the sun card you you are in the right direction and you've got the page of wands in here and you've got the ace of wands in here so it means that you are going to take it you're gonna take the road the person the situation that will ignite spark and also happiness you know you might go for someone new like this is this could be a new idea a new venture you know, I feel like you will switch from the past. Like, it could be a quick turnaround, Scorpio. Yeah, six of wands. I feel like, Scorpio, you're overthinking, you're feeling and thinking and feeling and thinking and feeling. 
until this tool offer comes along, you will somehow compare. Someone will tell you, you will, you will eventually go towards, okay, let me compare it, let me deal with it, you know, side to side, compare, you know, imagine you compare two spreadsheet, you know, like you're going to compare it side by side, six of ones, a judgment card. But I feel like going through towards together, side by side, you feel a little bit exhausted, you know, nine of wands, that you might just give it a try. Like it could be, okay, I want to do it side by side, maybe to offer. Let me just sit with it, look at it, compare it. And then eventually, for some reason, Scorpio, you will go for someone new. Yeah, look at that. Could be an Aries. Oh, wow. Look at that. This is so fiery. This is what's going to happen, Scorpio, is that for some of you guys, you're already sitting in this energy. For some of you guys, you're about to enter a vibe, an energy where you will have two choices, two person, the situation. One choice is coming from the past or it's someone, something that's already existing in your life. And there is a newcomer, a new face, a new character, a new offer. Okay, it's an ace of wands. Now, you're giving the chance to this newcomer while you keep the six of cups or someone in the past. And then you not you are navigating it both, comparing it both. And at some point, it's kind of tiring. This ace of wands, this new person, will do something impossible. It will do something that would change the game, that would change your mind. You know? And you will reward this person, the King of Swords. The King of Swords, the Justice card. Like this is more of when they do this or when this company offer this, when this person do this, when this company, you know, move, when they say this, you will eventually like, okay, I'm going to give this person or this situation the chance or I will focus on this because this is a big effort. You know, King of Swords, the Justice card in here. Wow. <laughs> You're going to give you a cup. Scorpio, two of cups. I tell you, this could be a romantic situation. This could be an offer. But something tells me you weren't, you were supposed to take your time. Something tells me that you were supposed to take your time. You were supposed to take your time, take it easy, chill. But this person, this situation is just unstoppable. And they offer you something big that it's so hard to resist. And you're like, okay logically if you do that that's game over it means that you're a choice you know for example there's two offers in in front of you this company saying i offer you one hundred thousand. the other company i offer you one hundred thousand too will you go for someone new or you know or maybe there's a little bit of difference but then the other did something okay i'm gonna offer you this double the price well that's like game over i feel like it's a new person that will come towards you and you will be very very shocked that you weren't expecting them to say that to do that you know it's it's just game over you know it's a feeling of you're doing this you're doing that you're undecided indecisive okay let me just navigate it bo back and forth both sides okay navigating it navigate you're, it's quite tiring and then the new person this new offer felt like you are stalling you know if this is love the new person felt like you're stalling scorpio you're making me wait I'm going to give you something, something that you wouldn't say no. And they did. And you did take that. You know, I tell you, this reading is something that you want to take it. You want to slow it down. Right? It's, it's a reading where it could be a person's situation. But, okay, you want to take things slowly. Scorpio, Scorpio likes to be in control. You're sort of taking it slowly. You're taking it slowly. But they could not take it that you are taking it slowly. And then they offer you something big just to propel it faster. And then you got their, they got what they want. Look at that. You gave. <laughs> you gave in. It could be love. Like it could be, okay, you know what? I'm just going to take it slow. And, you know, I'm not going to kiss this person until that. And then boom. They gave, they did something unforgettable. Like A for effort or E. Sorry, big effort. And you gave it. You gave the two of cups, Scorpio. <laughs> this is like 
I would say unexpected yes yeah someone is gonna convince you and do something and you will give someone your yes unexpectedly your heart your love unexpected like it's it's i say it's a mm, they will literally win your heart over scorpio i tell you mm -hmm. so this is what i have for you scorpio thank you so much for being here thank you so much for your support it's a pleasure doing the reading to you guys i will see you very soon you have a great day bye bye